Dan. Welcome to episode <laughs> two. Uh, are we going to episode this? Um, I, uh, well, I don't know, man. I have no plans. I'm, episode two. <laughs> I'm Daniel. I'm Matt. And I'm Struggy. <laughs> <laughs> Struggy, you sound, you sound different today. Struggy's DOA. Yeah, he's uh, AWOL. He's, uh, he's moving like planned with the last time. But anyway, we're, uh, we're playing something different today. Yeah. We're playing on a PlayStation 4, strangely enough. Man. And we're obviously playing Bloodborne. Crazy times. I know. Danny has upgraded. He's got a PS4. And Shit, I son. downgraded and got it, got rid of the three the Wii U. The Wii U. Oh, yeah, man. And with the old and with the new. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> so. Just I've had this for a weekend. I'm, uh, does it tell me how long I've been playing so far? I don't think so. I don't know. That's, that's too bad. I know. Man. Your gender is male. It is. Uh, I've, it is. I've learned so much already. All right. So, yeah, in this game, uh, I'm male. Okay. <laughs> and these are tombstones. And this is a doll. What? This is Bloodborne. <laughs> <laughs> it's very pretty. Is right that, off the is, gate, yeah. that is my first, yeah. going to be my first comment. So, we're going to, I guess what we, everybody's going to be wondering, well, who hasn't seen Bloodborne yet? How much is this like Dark Souls? That is a good question, and uh, what is what is the brass tax answer? Remarkably, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it is Dark Souls I, to a T. I kind of figured that was the case. Um, um, the only different, like main difference, I could tell, I guess, would be this area, because okay, fucked up enough to level yourself up, you go to this home, doll, God, which is, is literally a doll, channel Very your blood well. echoes. Which of I still call souls because it's the strength. same fucking thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And exactly the same way. Now, what I like about it is you're only limited to six different options right here. Okay. But right. That just makes things so much more easy. It's a little more streamlined. Yeah. A little less clumsy. Yeah. I, I tend to focus on strength because it kind of up, it kind of ups everything. Even your physical defense. I can't do anything now because I don't have any souls. We'll get there. Okay. But I'm hoping to at least get to level 20 by the end of this thing. Nice. So we'll nice. get there, but... This, it's the same. It's the same damn thing. Yeah, I heard it's. Uh, I heard that's pretty similar. Just, just change the terms to have blood in there. Yep. Uh, <laughs> and we have insight now instead of uh, being human, mm -hmm. I guess, or whatever those things were when you would turn. I can't remember. I don't know Dark Souls anymore. I'm, I'm bloodborne now. But <laughs> that's insight, old news. Yeah, insight makes it so that you can do special uh, things like if you can see in the top oh, wow, left corner. I'll actually, I'll just. May you Stop talking to me. All right. I could just bring it up here in the inventory, but if you have uh, this bell, mm -hmm. you can summon other people in your world, similar to Dark Souls. Oh, right on. Okay. I haven't done that yet. I, I'm an idiot, and I used a bell right away, and then I had to use a washroom. I canceled it. There goes my insight. Uh, <laughs> it was gone. Bummer. I couldn't use the bell since, so. Oh, well. And this is your home world, or whatever you would call it. It's called Hunter's Dream. Okay. If I remember correctly. All right. And this is your, you Very know, misty. Your, yeah, this is your, your home base area. So why are there uh, bloody skeletons coming out of the ground at your feet? What's uh, it, what it, oh, yes. It oh, says yes. Uh, View Spectre or something? Yes. What's that all So about? these are the uh, the notes that people can leave. Oh, okay. All right. And also, Don't give up. <laughs> Spectres are the, you know, how you can watch people's death scenes. Watch. Oh. Yeah. So you can die here? Absolutely. In this overworld. Yeah. Oh. I'm sure if I attacked her, she'd attack me too. What the hell kind of wheel thing? What? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where he got that from. As far as I've gotten, I can go to this headstone, and beyond that, I've I can't do any more awakenings. And also, I don't know what these are yet, but I know I need to conduct a ritual. And okay. Shit will go down. <laughs> Apparently so. I'm assuming that these are the dungeons Jeffrey talked about where they're really hard. Oh, right on. They have right some on. real fucking hard areas in the game, and I think that's what these are. Chalice dungeon? That's what these are. Okay, because, yeah, they're called chalice, chalice dungeons. Chalice dungeons. That's what All they are. Right. So these must be them. Uh, they're supposed to be fucking ridiculous. In case the rest of the game isn't hardcore enough for you, yep. that's where you go. The only major difference I find when in terms of combat, obviously you can't. It's it is a bit different because you're mostly holding a gun, yeah, and an axe. These are your weapons. It's cool. Um, you can switch it up. I don't. I got a torch, nice, and a gun. There's, there's I mean, 
There's not many weapons I could find so far, and I'm I'm probably eight hours in. Oh, okay. So, in terms of weapons, I can't really speak about, but like it. I mean, even your run and jump moves are in it. It's, yeah. it's just how you fight is pretty similar. You can even do like the that kind of attack, or you know, your heavy attacks are the same. Yeah. Like light attack, your jumping heavy attack is there. Good old From Software. They uh, they know what they're doing, yeah, well, and they don't change it up well, much. <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean to try to kill you just then. I don't want to die. <laughs> but what change? What makes the big change is that you can't use shields. Oh yeah, okay. That's... So two-handed fighting mm -hmm. seems more worth it now. Makes sense. Yeah. Because you only rely on your dodge, which is in this game when you're targeting someone. I'll you know what? I'll just get out of here and we'll go somewhere. Okay. Cool. When you're targeting someone, it's all about sidestepping them. Somewhere. It's not so much rolling or how much equipment, I guess, you have on you that, that brings you down as much as knowing what the fuck you're doing. Okay. So, there's that. It's a bit different. Yeah. It's more of a focus on uh, mobility, I guess, and dodging the fuck out of the way. <laughs> yep. That can say is pretty cool. Oh, yeah. The load times. <laughs> Post-patch are still shit. Yeah. <laughs> they are. At least when you're first time going through somewhere like this, it's it's complete and utter shit. Yeah, yeah. It's a little long, but... It is. When you're dying constantly at a boss, it's yeah. long. Yeah, it would get frustrating. As you can see, we have lamps. Uh, one thing that, did that, that they changed drastically yeah. is if you're farming for souls, you can't just click on this and reset everything. Oh, You have to bummer. change areas to do so. Oh, okay. Uh, it slows things down a bit, but it's nothing. It's nothing too bad. Yeah. As you can see, this is where the first boss is. Is the cleric boss, and he's a bitch. He's <laughs> cheap as fuck. So, warning for anybody first playing, he's a cheap son of a bitch. Yeah. Let's move on here and get into some combat with some really fun beings. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, hello. These are you giant ravens, and this guy. Jesus. Bullets don't do shit. <laughs> they don't? Well, they don't. well, on the ravens, they do some damage. I'll okay. kill a raven with bullets. Yeah, check that out. Um, bigger enemies, I use it more for getting them to... Stay the fuck away? <laughs> oh, jeez. I love the are... weight that they manage. Like, everything feels really heavy yep. in these games. You uh, know? In Bloodborne, particularly, you can see there's big crows. Yeah. There's big everything. <laughs> the rats are gigantic. The bosses are massive. Everything seems so big. Yeah. So when you first try the game and you go up on even the, like this, even the, the the most oddest of enemies. Yeah. In a normal game, you wouldn't think anything of. And this one, like a, a crow, was just like, like fuck, he's huge. Intimidating <laughs> as fuck. Yeah. Great animations in these things too. And uh, yeah, check the, the physics. detail on the <laughs> physics. <laughs> Ah, typical. <laughs> nice, yeah. <laughs> there you go. So real. <laughs> I was hoping more things would be breakable. Like you can tell that's breakable. You can tell these aren't. Oh, okay, yeah. And no. uh, this, you, you know, it's not. Yeah. It, I, I can. Static I noticed that in the game. There is not as. There's not many breakable objects. Like it's okay. Yeah. But, yeah. Oh, <laughs> that guy's unhappy about it. Yeah. A dick. <laughs> like this is breakable. This is not. Just things like that. Oh, these guys are not fun. They hey, let's show everybody a glitch. First thing we can do here is do a glitch. Why not? Uh, why not? Just Whoa. Glitch. That's a lot of blood that just came out of both of y'all. <laughs> yeah, I, I like the, uh, oh, shit. Oh, ah. my God. No. Blood. Oh, okay. That belongs inside your body. All right. So, and so, the basic premise of this game is uh, there's an infection going around, and you're infected as well. Is that it? <laughs> or they don't tell you? They don't tell you? <laughs> there's a story. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not one for stories in this type of stuff. Oh, okay, I just right. love to play the game. Yeah. Oh my god. It's the challenge for these games. I'm not even one for challenge, but for some reason, Dark Souls is always... I'm sorry, I'm gonna call this Dark Souls a lot, I know, because <laughs> I still have not found much of a difference. Yeah. This is Dark Souls 3 to me. Yeah, you're just being real. And you know what? I, I, I wouldn't want it any other way, to be honest. Yeah. You know what you're getting into. Oh, right. Charge attacks. These okay. are devastating if you can pull them off. They're great. 
And they're simple enough just to hold the R2 button. Um, that's okay. that's two-handed. There's one for this as well. Nifty. That fucking flattens people on the ground. I really like the way he changes between uh, his gun and just holding the longer scepter or whatever, scythe or whatever yeah, you call it. Yeah, it's a great little like, animation. It's really cool. Right. Such a badass. Oh, and the scale is... Uh, really impressive. It's like you can just, it's one of those, you look up there, you can go there. Okay, games, all right? right. Like it's not, it almost looks like the detail of the area is not pre-rendered over there. It, it, it looks like the, the proper depth and di yeah. distance for, for something. It doesn't look like a piece of fucking wood put over a <laughs> canvas kind of Sky box thing. Skybox, like there yeah. you go. It, it, you know, it looks, it looks natural. Yeah. Actually, I'm looking to see if I can see enemies all the way down there. <laughs> Probably not. I mean, there's only so many, so many things you can really do right now. But yeah, Bloodborne's a little bit of a tricky little game. Oh right. well, yeah, there he goes. Yeah, that's a fun area. Now, <laughs> if everybody's wondering where we're going, we're gonna try and fight that other boss if I can remember how the fuck to get there. Let's take a chance mm. at it. Let's. I can say, let's do it, because I don't have to do anything. Uh, I just have to watch. <laughs> watch the terror. I already got to him one time, and uh, I think it's a great fitting fight, because it's basically you fighting another hunter, as you guys are called in this. Oh, okay. Uh, not the easiest of enemies or things to fight, but not the funnest <laughs> thing to fight. Uh, it's Dark Souls. Yeah. Dark Souls, so you point out. It's, it's Dark Souls. It's just, you just do it and hope for the fuck you win. <laughs> Please let me win, game. Oh. Okay. Didn't I kill them? Yeah, okay, they're dead. All right. So, so that was a shadow of you, or a ghost of you. What was that all about? Oh, that white thing? Yeah, yeah. Those are specters. Um, oh, okay. Just the same thing. They're, they're the ones who are other players that are walking around the world. There's a lot of dogs down here. Dogs are fucking ferocious. Fucking but very dogs. weak. Oh, they're very high, fast. High offense, low defense. Yeah. Gotcha. If I may find one or wolf or whatever you want to call it. What a canine creature. These things. <laughs> Some quadruped. Oh my fuck. I'm not about to let one attack me. Yeah. So if he gets me, good on him, but I'm not about to let it out because <laughs> they're very fast. Yep. I'll gladly take their souls. Oh, and Matt has not played the game yet. No. He will be soon. Oh dear. <laughs> I'd love yeah, to get someone's. That's frightening. Yeah, I'd like to get someone's take on just. You know the learning curve the learning. of a uh, of someone who hasn't played this yet. Oof. I haven't even really played any uh, Dark Souls or Demon Souls or any. Oh really? Nope. Oh Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> they're always so daunting. Okay. Oh. It's uh, they're they're quite they're quite the adventure. <laughs> okay, so there's a hidden path over here. I already got all the items for that, so I'm not about to. Uh, okay. To go in there. Oh Danger. look, we have a viewer. Hello. <laughs> he can't hear me. No, they can't. But that's okay. One day we will figure that part out. But as of right now, fuck that. Yeah. One step at a time. Oh man, make him smell it. Critical. He's, uh, Critical. Oh sh. I love how. Is this uh, doing you're so bloody. You're, you're covered yeah, in nice blood. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> good animation shooting this. Really, really cool. Gross, but cool. I came to find out that Dark Souls 2 is actually out on PS4. What? Yeah, it's For cool. Real I did not know. I don't know if it looks much better or not, but... Yeah. Blood vials are what you use to heal yourself. You'll Alrighty. use a lot of them, but you know what? They are very... Very plentiful. As you can tell, I'm full. I can't, I'm always full on them. You're flush with blood vials. Yeah. Um, in your health meter, it's going to be hard to show this, but your health, when you get hit, it goes down, but you get an orange block. Yeah. Uh, that's actually refillable by killing enemies. The more you hit, and like, while that, if you get hit, and then immediately 
you know, start hitting the other guy, your health will actually go back up. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, by, by maybe half or 75% of it. Cool. But you have to do it in a certain amount of time to get it. Makes sense. Yeah. So that's uh, that's another little Keep attacking. feature. We need to go down here. Best defense is a good offense. <laughs> We're going to try to get to this boss um, and try to kill him. Rats. Oh, they're so gross. Rats. <laughs> Rats aren't gross, really, but those rats are fucking. These rats look jolly. Like, they really remind me of the old game. Nasty. They're straight out of Dark Souls, are they? Yeah, very much. <laughs> Some nappy ass rats. He's gonna make a little pause. Like, rats in Newfoundland, here, this is what they look like. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get through this fucking sewer. Well, hopefully I remember where I gotta go here. I, it wasn't too hard of a trek to get to the boss. Oh, okay. He kind of just comes out of nowhere. Act, actually, they all do. They <laughs> yeah, all I was gonna too, say actually. that sounds in character. He's just like, he just kind of jumps out at you and is like, "Hey, buddy, it's Booga! Fuck. <laughs> it's boss time. Yeah. It's like a pop quiz." Uh, <laughs> back here. Can I climb that ladder? Running around in the sewer. I don't think I climbed that ladder. Quality might be a little bit low because it's, you know, streaming the Twitch. No, we're using the Twitch video. It's the best we could do, y'all. Yeah. That's how it is. Just, just learn to Oh, yes, it. this part. Do I got to do that again? <laughs> oh, those look cool. Oh, yeah. Zombies. They're, they're real fun. Zombies. They're quite easy, but there was an item down there I already got. Do I want to go down there? Matt, should I go down there? I did, well, I guess if you don't have to go crawling around with the zombies, oh, then no, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> they're not overly difficult enemies. But yeah. Oh, I do remember I went down here, so maybe it's a good idea to do something. Okay. Better safe than sorry. Man, you get to kill things. And, and plus, you know, it never hurts to have some blood. I don't even know what to call it, souls. Yeah. To uh, to lose at a boss anyway. It's always nice to have. Very true. Justin, I'm sorry you're missing out, buddy. Yeah, <laughs> sorry, Justin. I'll, uh. Regards to struggle. <laughs> My memory is struggling. <laughs> I can't never tell, you know, what the physics of these things. Yeah, no, it's They're like, is it alive. dead or am I just, yeah. Is it still alive or am I just kicking it around? We're very early on in the game, so. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean early, from what so, I've heard. So low, low on the spoilers. Yeah. We're not gonna. Now, how hard is this game compared to Dark Souls? I've heard it's a lot easier. So oh, yeah? far from my experience, it is and it isn't. Um, getting to the second lamp or lantern, what will be a uh, 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 bonfire? Bonfire, yeah. Was a an excruciating experience. <laughs> I, will, I don't time, like the sound of that. It was bad. By the time I got to it, it was about, I was about an hour in. It took about an hour to get from point A to point B, yeah. and I was sweating. <laughs> Very much. And I that was the end of the game for me that last night. Okay. I, yeah, it's like I, I don't know burned. if I took a wrong turn somewhere or not, but it was bad. I had to fight a lot of shit. I had like I had at least probably ten thousand souls by the time I did it. Which is a lot. That's a lot of souls. I'd like to I gotta stop calling this souls. Did I have blood sharks? Well, uh, I don't know. Blood something. Figure it out in a minute. <laughs> I'm in the middle of something. Damn. Killing some zombies. They are fucking. Doesn't say. Uh, blood echoes. Okay. Oh, right. Alright. Try to keep shit real. Oh, the pig! Oh, jeez. The sorry. pig? I'm here, like, slapping my pops in the microphone. The pig! Believe it or not, he was very easy the first time around. Do I need to fight him or do I climb the ladder? I can't remember. I fought him. Let's Jesus. Whoa! And you and you were victorious. Him. Any more? Any more? <laughs> All good? Y'all dead now? Alright, I'm gonna hit hit up one more just so I got full. And yep. Come on out, boy. Oh no, I'm gonna shoot this guy. Fuck you, pig. Speed him up a bit. Sewer pig. 
He's taking his sweet time about it. Jeez. Oh my god. Here comes. Here, pig. Oh my god. He's, oh, he's so big and gross. Oh man, you are raping him. You just, oh. But see, that's what I mean. Like, a lot of the enemies that you're going to be like, oh, fuck, <laughs> are not so difficult. Yeah. Um, another thing, too. You only get 20 bullets. Only 20? Yeah, as you so, can see up where my health bottles are. Okay, yeah, bottles, yeah. You only get 20 bullets at a time. I'm going to do it now anyway just to show up, but you can do this, uh, that, hmm. and that drains your health, but gives you five extra bullets. Oh, cool. They will disappear when you die. Huh. So it's kind of a sacrifice if you want extra bullets, which is kind of fucked up because they don't really do much. No, I was going to say, it doesn't seem like it would be worth it. Uh, now we're bullets. early game. Maybe yeah, later maybe, in game maybe, yeah. they'll be much more prevalent. But right now they're not really worth much. Let me guess, guys. So it's a dead end, right? Doop a doop a doop. Derp. Doop. Is he going to derp? Push it. Derp. Derp. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's obviously a dead end. So <laughs> go that well, way. Well, we learned something from that yeah. specter. All right. We'll go up this ladder. <laughs> I can't remember if this is the one I went to, but it's copy break. Oh, yeah, coffee's... I wish I hadn't drank all my coffee. God damn. Dude, that quick? Your coffee's too good, man. We got I, the show to do, I, yeah. I know. <laughs> I should have I should have ordered two coffees. Oh. It's, all right, so we're heading up to... Am I going the right way? What the fuck? Okay, this is definitely not the area I was in before. <laughs> I don't think I see that. Or did I? Or did I fight? Actually, I think I did fight you, didn't I? Yeah, Dark S or Bloodborne is a game <laughs> of uh, dodging. It's definitely a lot of yeah. dodging. What's up, buddy? Yes, this is the way I went. Yes. Okay. Okay, yes, I do remember these guys. These ones are kind of tricky. I think. They're, they're, they hit pretty hard. They look like it. Look at them. Jesus. Swinging that shit around I everywhere. Go up here because I don't know what's up here. I'd like to kill. Yeah. You don't want to get more shit after you. Hit them! <laughs> <laughs> shit! I need more stamina. Yeah, there you go. Oh wow, that was scary as fuck. Okay. <laughs> Shit got real. Why is things so scary? Well, mm. because all the work you do up to this point, if you die, you lose your, your your blood echoes, and you need to come get them back. If you don't make it back, like in Dark Souls. Yes. We're gonna be referencing that a lot because it's it's Dark Souls. Yeah. Uh, it's you not lose it for bush. for good. Yeah. So. There we go. This door. Oh, cool thing. Yeah. These only show up when you die at a boss. Really? Yeah, so if, if before the boss, like my first time coming up here, this wasn't here. Yeah, okay. Like Dark Souls would have the door here. You know you're heading into something. Yeah. Uh, that's why, I mean, everything kind of hits you. You uh, just walk into okay. a fight. Yeah. Um, this so, time they kind of mark it. Yeah, now I know. Now the cutscene's not going to play for the original, for the boss, which was a neat cutscene. Now I'm going to walk in and I'm going to enjoy fighting this little bitch. Nightmare fog. So they put up that nightmare fog for ones that you died at. Yeah. That's kind of cool. I like it. It, it even looks nifty. Fuck me. <laughs> this guy's hard. Oh, there we go. Get out. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm going to try. I already fought him once. I did yeah. okay, but let's see if I can do all right again. You need to dodge him a lot. Yeah, sure looks like it. He's constantly attacking. And he does he does look a lot like you, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you he tell. seems like he's the old hunter, I guess. Yeah. This is mostly the yeah. like, I'm only saying this for people who really care about the story for this stuff. It's not for me, but I just oh. love the game for what it is. Yeah. 
And I feel bad too that, that you know I didn't give this game. Oh, there we go. Uh, I didn't give this game as much thought as I should have back when it first came out. Ah well. But that's what you gotta do. Hindsight is twenty twenty. I died. And I don't plan on you going sure to retrieving did. those stalls right now. Now is a good time for you to take a shot at it. Oh, buddy. There you go. All right. Yeah, it's Controls a... are ugh. different. R two is our heavy attack. L R one is light attack. L one uh, changes you to your guns to two handed. Triangle heals you. Right stick click gets on your enemies, things like that. Okay, so I got, yeah, that switches. So, uh, R1 and R2 do different swings. Yes, and R2 is a heavy attack, R1 is your light attack. And what's L2? L2 does look at a different one still. Uh, L2 should be R2, same as R2. Oh, okay, yeah, they're both just heavy yeah. swings, okay. One thing that I'm definitely going to have to change you know what that is? You know, can can do you know what itch was? I will tell you what itch was. How do I hit start on this motherfucker? It's, it's dark and oh, okay. There's the start button. I I'm not familiar options with the fucking button. options. Yeah. What? There is no. Oh, so, sorry. Be careful. <laughs> Don't press the share button. It's on the other side of this options button. Okay, so that will cut the stream this, off. This is the share button. Yeah, I don't the select. That. <laughs> I'll, I'll call it select because let's be honest, it's select. I'm old touchpad school. Touchpad got two buttons, both on the left and right touchpad two buttons. What the fuck? The future scares me. I'm an old man. Um, <laughs> I pooped. Uh, all right, where are the system controls? Oh yeah, that sweet Y axis. Needs oh jeez, mm. you're one of them. <laughs> oh, I am so one of them. You've learned that about me here today. So I'm one of those weirdos that control controls like an airplane all the time. I blame GoldenEye. I think GoldenEye was the first game that really yeah. made me do that. Let's see how you deal with those three enemies up ahead, or probably four: the crows and the. The gargantuan All right, son of a bitch. Let's, let's see. This is gonna be so easy. Easy Back peasy. Back a life before we cut off today. Okay. All right. <laughs> one one life to live. One life to live. So do I have like spells? Should I be shooting shooting the you, fuckers? You you basically just got what you okay, got. Okay, I got what I got. You don't know me. You don't know what I got. I got a man giant. Oh jeez. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm old Greg. Sorry, I really, I really love the mighty boots. Yeah. Oh my god. Yes. Yeah, suck it down. How do you like me now? You're not so tough. Nice. Now take on the other two guys. You're not the boss of me, Danny. <laughs> okay. Well, hello. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. She's <laughs> <Like, laughs> sitting, <too. laughs> What? Yeah. Oh, my God. All right. I've had enough fun with the physics. Let's uh, let's move on, shall we? All right. So, clicking. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, it kind of locks on? Yeah. You can, you can uh, right click and it'll lock on. Oh, nice. Look at me. And, you're you're uh, sidestep now instead of how do I, okay so yeah all right you ain't got nothing you ain't got nothing on me too fast pretty mm. yeah the combat in this is a lot more fast than Dark Souls or where Demon Souls used to be they're, they're very slow combat with those games yeah it used to feel kind of lumbering now it's a little more uh, yeah you're you're a, you're a little you're, more you of feel a badass like you're, you know. Like you're more of an athletic kind of person <laughs> who should be doing this shit. Yeah. How do I? Uh, how do I shoot? Oh yeah. Okay. Ba bam. Ba bam. You're bitches. Mm, you're ugly. Mm. All right. That doesn't do much. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Holy shit. What the fuck? What's happening? All right. Die. No. 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 Uh, I'm. I'm dead. That's bloodborne. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we're going to be back in about in a minute or so with uh, with another game just to show off. All right. And uh, yeah, we'll be cool. back in a sec. And I, I want to play more Bloodborne now. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. 
I'm going to keep those recording, and we're just going to cut this off. Cue. Peace and carrots, pistol. Mm, peace and, and carrots. This is, uh, this is Tower of Guns, uh, another PS4 game, which was a PlayStation Plus, uh, PlayStation Plus free game. Oh, back, nice. Uh, nice. Well, it, at the viewing of this show, it would have been last week, because the new ones roll out on Tuesday. Cool. Anyway. Which is like guacamole and stuff. Anyway, anyway, yeah, this is Tower of Guns, and it's got to be one of my favorite games of all time. Of all time. Of all time. Holy shit, dude. I want to not play it. Uh, (laughs) I'm going to set Matt up with a... uh, We're going to do difficulty minus minus damage armor and loot plus plus. XP plus plus. The reason that I'm doing that is because that way Matt will get a... A really quick idea of what the game offers. And Matt, I'm going to give you... Uh, we got a choice between a pea shooter, um, a pizza gun, a gatling <laughs> gun, a, a fucking hand cannon, or something that shoots like... It's almost like a shotgun, but it shoots really fast. Well, that sounds cool. I mean, this shotgun. One? Yeah, this yeah. It's, it's glowing and pulsating, man. Come on. Look. Well, they are. Oh, okay. But <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give Matt the controller to play this. The reason right. that I'm doing this is because... My initial impression of this game, oh, they're, they're giving you some bonuses. What? You just walk straight on through. Oh, my God. You just, they right. just give you some extra cash and stuff to start off because it's, I think it's my 10th time. Oh, look at this cake on the floor. It's a cake. Welcome no, back to okay. Cake Town. <laughs> oh, okay, I can jump. Yeah, you know what I'm going to have to do, though? <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, fuck <laughs> I better remember to fix this. <laughs> Invert aim. Yeah, you're going to be cursing me later, and it's going to be <laughs> great. It's the little things that make uh, life worth living. Whoa. Oh, Matt, Check one sec. Yeah. Okay. All right. That'll fix it. Cake down. Stage complete, man. I'm good at this game. <laughs> good job, man. <laughs> cake, cake down is my town. Foyer. Now, I don't think we're going to let you finish the whole game because it's right. quite long. Okay, well, it's right. not long, but yeah, it'll yeah. take you about 45 minutes. Okay. Um, Mothership. Now, while Matt's playing this, I'm going to go over what this is. Okay. This is a roguelike um, first-person shooter with ever-changing maps. Every every map is different, like every most <laughs> roguelikes. And you get lots of loot. Um, you can upgrade your gun with the blue stuff. The red stuff gives you uh, gives you health and all that kind of stuff. And you get money to buy things. But where this game sets itself different mm-hmm. is there's a lot of secrets and stuff in it as well. A lot of collectibles, a lot of weapons. The maps are always different. Really interesting bosses. And it's called Tower of Guns for a reason. Yeah. You'll see in a second. Okay. This is why. Oh, all right. Tower of Guns is a game that has a multitude of different kind of enemies that all revolve around guns and you scaling a tower. Ah. You're constantly, what you're trying to do is get to the top of the tower and basically, you know, to the core, blow yes. it up. Yeah. We're at least going to get, uh, I'd say, one level in, maybe two. We'll see how it goes. See how okay. the time goes. But, and that'll give you an idea of what kind of bosses you can expect. Um, every single level is different. It's always randomly generated. Cool. The secrets can consist of you walking through walls or falling through floors. All right. And the only way you can see them is by just randomly walking into one or shooting at it, and it, your bullet's not oh, okay. just right. going through like nothing's there. Nice. That's old school. Oh yeah, shit. it's a it's it's a very old school style shooter that that incorporates roguelike um, gameplay. Highly addictive. I could see that. Uh, Highly it's, addictive. It's strangely fun. Yeah. Uh, I find it reminds me a lot of uh, Heavy Bullets, uh, that game I was talking about a while back, in that it's uh, a very simplistic sort of uh, FPS take that's oddly addictive. And I realize the sound is a bit loud. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah but that's all right. Right that rap. <laughs> <laughs> It'll all work out in the end. Okay, they, I can't seem to hit those right yet. Wait, it must need me to kill this guy. Can I kill you from down here? Yeah, suck it. Oh, shit. 
The guns will get bigger, they will get stronger. You can get uh, perks, um, new weapons, items, everything on your playthrough. Okay. As you can see, Matt has a little sucker pacifier pacifier in the bottom right corner saying that he's a he's a little baby because he's playing on the easiest difficulty oh, okay, with the perk right. that makes him give him everything but that's what makes it fun that's the game can be real hard there's a nightmares perk where you get when you finish the game Holy every shit. enemy is a champion enemy which is a big green dude okay and uh and everything just it, it's just nothing's in your favor okay very di i got to level two and i died instantly Ouch. very difficult Yeah, it seems, uh, oh, it seems nice and forgiving now, but I, I could definitely understand yeah, that. It, would it's, it's not, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the, the damage, the level scale substantially with each, with each level yeah. area you get to. Oh, disc to the face. I'm just eating damage here. Suck it. <laughs> Yeah, you get a lot of enemies to come out of there. You know? <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, I fell. My the biggest... maps are just so awesome. They yeah. can be so big. And you get you get, you get bonuses uh... too for finding the secrets. Like, you can unlock extra weapons just for finding extra more secrets. The more secrets you find the level. Oh, okay, cool. So, this is it, real incentive. Yeah, there's the, incentives uh... to do every everything in this game. Every aspect of it has an incentive to do something about it. Cool. Kept getting loot gives you an incentive to get a gun. Uh, getting, uh, like I said, finding secret, the more secrets you can find gives you incentives to get another gun. Finishing the game on the part times and stuff will get you another gun. Things like that. Cool. And all the guns are really different. And you can level them up to five levels. Nice. Is this gun leveled up at all? The one that you're I'm at using? level three right now. You're oh, about okay. to level four. I was gonna say it seems like a good gun. No, I don't say that much. Oh my god. <laughs> One of your perks can actually make you jump three times. In the really? Game. Yeah. Wow. That would be useful. I like the, uh... I like the pace of it. Like the... It's not oh, super Now, if you look fast. to your left, or behind you, yeah. you can see the arrows are pointing to, uh, I guess, where you gotta go. Okay, yeah. They also can point to secret areas. Oh, good. And you're at a boss. And it looks like you're going to be fighting the, uh, yeah, the spike room, which means that the, the room is going to close on you until you kill it. Oh, okay. So you had to kill the actual spike. Oh, which right. is, uh, up there. Up there, the big yeah, flashy here. thing? That would be the boss. Oh my god. <laughs> Remember, you're on the easiest difficulty right now. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. Yeah. Round. And then, you know, you kill the boss. Whoa, I almost knocked down the mic, mic again. I almost oh, dropped man. the mic. Almost dropped the mic. You got Burst Happy Cash. Or burst cats. Happy Cat. Press square. Square. <laughs> I don't know what that does, but that's pretty awesome. Uh, but cool. all right. Yeah, lots of stuff like that. It's all pretty cool. And, that you know, you cool. finish stuff. You can kill those little guys or keep them. I don't. I kill them because they give me stuff. And but they look so friendly. They do. They do. <laughs> look at the little thing. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he that. didn't please me. That's cool, man. I I like this. I approve of this game, especially killing these guys. <laughs> no, just All right. Well, we're gonna go film the show. Yeah. Um, so we got what episode are we anyway. up to now? Do you know? Do you oh remember? man, I don't know. I think we're at seventy-five. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> That's how far off yeah, we are. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to say on record it's 39. And so if you want to hear more about Bloodborne and this game, you can head over to episode yeah. 39 on our website and check us out. Oh, and we're going to be angry on this one. Yes, sir. So There's yep. going to be rants to be had. So <laughs> if you enjoy listening to nerds get pissed off, yep. tune on in. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. Well, thank you for watching and I'll see you there. See you there. Boom. <laughs>